I've obviously been gone for almost a month, half a month, and I need to tell you why, and why I've been on and off so much during this channel. Um, this is sort of a secret, I guess I've been forced to hold in, but I don't care anymore, and I'm just going to say it. It's pretty much been going on since a little bit after I first moved, um, from my hometown, and when that happened, pretty much there was a uh, battle between my mom and dad deciding who I would live with, and pretty much we're uh, going through court, and uh, yeah. That time period, I didn't make video like as much due to either depression or else just um, having to go from my dad's and my mom's because um, after all that started happening, then there was a uh, thing where I had it each other weekend I had to go to one of the places. So, yeah. So then, um, come summer, then come summer. It was pretty much two weeks on, two weeks off. Uh, two weeks I was with my mom, two weeks I was with my dad. That one place didn't have internet for me to actually like do these videos, so that's why you would see sometimes I would do a bunch of videos one like one week, and then the other week I'd be completely missing. So that explains that. Pretty much since this has almost been it's going to be soon a year that this has been going on. Uh, obviously both of them has been fighting constantly and I've been just pretty much stuck in the middle. And at times the pretty much, or one of the two, take it out of me. And it's just rough on me. Um, I personally didn't want to tell you guys just the fact that this isn't your problem. But it's been interfering with this so much that now... I sort of have to tell you or else I'd be lying and I I can't drag myself into that mess so that's the truth pretty much I'm going through having to decide between two parents that are pretty much just fighting over me and I'm stuck in the middle while both of them are pretty much saying it's just one of us or else you're a two-timer so, yeah, I got to choose one of my parents, and one of them's going to love me, and the other one's pretty much going to hate me. So, yeah, I didn't really want to talk about this at all, um, for my sake and yours, but uh, Jimmy knows about it, a lot of my other friends know about it, but uh, that's a fact. Now, I was um, pretty much forced into uh, football, but uh, since this is my first uh, high school year, um, I didn't want to do sports this year, but um, my mom forced me to do it anyway, and I tried doing it, and it wouldn't interfere with me seeing my dad for my last two weeks before school would have started. So I decided to go see my dad because this would be my last time to see him before school started and then obviously school you can't go back and forth between two weeks or else you'd be missing away too much. So I go and decide to see him and when I come back apparently I am grounded for not doing sports. Um, my parents say that it's actually due to me swearing on this channel but you can say what you want about this but I'd say it's just plain coincidence that she'd grab me right the day that I decide to stop football and then say it's because of my YouTube channel but she knew that I was using this language already and didn't do a thing about it I'm not sure if that makes sense to you or not but I don't know anyhow so I'm just having trust issues with my family right now and I'm just trying to decide if I can trust anybody right now, really. Um, honestly, this YouTube thing is something that I feel like is my escape from, honestly, all that. So, there it is. You guys really are the thing that makes me happy. And I'm just grateful that you guys are still by my side. 
So thank you guys, and I'm so sorry that I couldn't keep doing as much as I could. I mean, heck, we're almost at a thousand because of you guys. You guys really are changing my life dramatically. And it's a little bit strange that I feel that the people in my life are almost trying to drag me down instead of lift me up, so. Now, with the grounding situation, whatever, um, honestly, I don't even care anymore. I really don't. Technically, I'm still grounded, but to just yell at me for not being what apparently my mom wanted me to be, just doing that, I'm not going to be your pawn. I'll get good grades, I'll get everything else, but I mean, I'm not going to be a pawn. I don't want somebody deciding my life for me. Simple as that. And if that means I get punished for it, for me actually standing up on my two feet, then fine. It's either that I'm a coward or I say what is the truth and get yelled at for it. Honestly, I hate to say it like this, but this has really been psychological for me. Not to a point where it's breaking me down completely, but to a point where... I'm really thinking back and forth about things. And no matter what I do, I'm still going to get hit by a double-bladed sword. One way or the other, I'm going to get stabbed because I am in the middle of this. I'm completely done for. And anyway, so when I was about to get in trouble and stuff, apparently my mother couldn't even make up her mind at first she said apparently I would be grounded until the entire football season would be over and now she's saying two weeks and then she changes up for being grounded from YouTube uh, and then friends and then not friends and then so I don't even know anymore and then when there's already things going on within the families where there's fighting and there's just all that I, I don't even care anymore. if they can't even take care of themselves then what's the point I understand that you're supposed to respect your family members, but you know, if sometimes they even question you being family, why should I? I mean, really, I'm done dealing with it, and if I get yelled at, if this may be my last video, because everybody else says that I'm wrong, it doesn't even give me a chance, because I have to be a certain way. That's perfectly fine with me, because at least I opened up my mouth and said something instead of being a little coward sitting in the corner not doing anything about my life. I don't care how much this beats me, okay? I just want to live my life. And if somebody says I have to be a certain way or change, do this thing all the time to points where it's almost unreasonable, no. No. I'm not going to deal with that. Jimmy, um, tried to s just keep this away from everybody, so thank you, Jimmy, for not saying anything. And still trying to keep everybody informed that I will be gone still on your channel. So thank you, but... Okay, anyways, other than movies, um... My friend Josh, as you know, Blue Digit, hasn't made any videos because of family issues and stuff, okay? So... He'll be back in two weeks, so yeah, um, he'll be back. Uh, he's just gone for a while. He's taking a break. Um, I'm not gonna specify it's his business, so I know why, but I'm not gonna tell you guys because um, I told him that I promised that I wouldn't say anything about it. So yeah, um, he'll be back in two weeks. Uh, I mean, yeah, this is the problem. Problem that. I don't even know who I can trust, rely on, or even call family anymore. I don't want this to sound like, hey, my life is worse than yours. Because I get it. People do that all the time. I broke my leg. Oh my gosh. I don't have this much money. Oh my gosh. And you know, I get it. But I just want to inform you guys that this is what's been happening. So you guys that have actually been sincerely worried, because I've been seeing some comments about that. I am sincerely sorry that I haven't said anything. I've really been afraid to say anything about this because 
my family doesn't want me to say anything about it, but you know, I'm not going to keep my mouth shut because they're too scared for me to say the facts. And if this is going to be the last video that I do make, because I get in major trouble for this, or I said too much, or I wasn't how I was supposed to be, I just want to say thank you guys so much for actually supporting me all this journey. If I can still keep making videos after this, then I'll keep doing them. But I really need your guys' support on this subject, please. You guys really are the people who make me smile. Whether that's a good thing or not in your eyes, that's you guys really do make a difference. And I don't want you guys feeling that I do not notice you, because I always will notice you. I notice every single comment. Okay, I notice every single little thing that you guys say. Everything. And I know I didn't, haven't commented back to a few of them because I've just been worried about the subject, as I've been saying, but no matter what happens, just know that I am sincerely thankful for what you guys have been doing for me, for the support and help that I've been getting throughout this entire time that I've been on this channel. I don't care what it takes, I, I'm not going to give up on this. If you want to know more about this, then I'll talk about another video. But this is the facts. This is why I made a bunch of other videos where I'm depressed in them. But, you know, even with all the short time that I've had, that doesn't matter. Because we still are so close to 1,000 subs. Because we did this. Without a struggle such as this, that is unbelievable in my eyes. Just the determination put into this. And to get that result is amazing in my eyes. For what this channel's progress has been, that is just awesome. I really am thankful to you guys being there for me. And I, I love to hear you guys' what you would say about this. I really want to know what your what your thoughts about this are. I really do, because I understand that this subject could be debatable, and I want to know everything every single thing that you say so that it might change or improve my sight of the issue so thank you guys so much for being there just know i love you all okay guys so thank you for having my back My name is Blue Sanya. Bye guys. Whoop.